How do you like my ride? Look at this! Okay, I'm coming out! I'm not Daddy Dave, I'm Shelly from Morning Live and we're here at the Rockton Fair, the world's Rockton Fair. It's about to begin later on this afternoon. Okay, I'm out. This is part of the Demolition Derby, folks. Deanna, president of the Rockton Fair. Thanks for having us. Thanks for coming today. <laughs> I smell like uh, diesel and gasoline a little bit, but uh, tell us, so what's happening with the Demolition Derby here at the Rockton Fair? It's running Friday, Saturday, and Sunday evening, and it's a fan favorite. Uh, this is a local legends car, and he runs the figure eights. It's Impact Motorsports is running the show for us this year, and it's a full production. Wow, so Daddy Dave. So what is it about it that people love? You say it's a fan favorite. Why do you think that is, Deanna? I think it's the atmosphere, it's the music, it's the chatter, it's the excitement. It's it's everything put together and people feel like they're coming together and watching a performance. Absolutely. I mean, it's just it's just looking at this car itself to think about what it's going to be doing this weekend. And of course, so much going on this weekend at the fair. Why do they call it the World's Fair? I just think it's because we're the best fair. <laughs> She's certain, yeah. Great food, shows, you have lots of rides going on. Just so much that we're going to talk about this morning on Morning Live. Again, you are the president. How do you like being the president of this greatest fair? <laughs> it's been a fantastic experience. It's like the whole community is coming together and working together to put on a great show for everyone in the area. Right, and the weather is going to be great. It's starting to look like fall now. The leaves are changing all around us. You have the mums out. Everyone is getting ready to welcome everyone in the community from around regions, cities, maybe people even traveling from afar to come and see the Rockton World's Fair. That all begins later on today, running through the entire weekend and coming up, we're gonna talk a whole lot more about it. Thanks, Deanna. Thank you. Good luck, Daddy Dave, with this car. Good morning, Holly. Are you be jolly? Holly? Hi, everyone. This is Holly, be jolly. You're drooling a little bit, Holly, but you're still so beautiful. We are at the Rockton World's Fair. Hasn't quite opened, but it will later on today, running all weekend. The weather is going to be beautiful. It's a family affair. We have Deanna, the president. Deanna, what are we going to be talking about right now in this segment? This is about 4-H. It's about the 4-H beef show in particular. So she'll be exhibiting her animal here at the fair. Okay, and what's your name? Paige. Paige, can you tell us a little bit about Holly here? Uh, she is pregnant with um, a baby inside of her, and she's going to have it on Jan in January. You know, I think she knew what you were saying, because when you said she has a baby inside of her, her ears went back. <laughs> See, she knows. Tell us a little bit more about her. What about her color? It's so pretty. Um, she is... Red, well, she, her breed is a Simmetal and a... How about I ask Dad over here? Her breed is, a, she's a Simmetal cross Charlet. That's where the silver color comes from, mixing, uh, mixing the black and the white paints together. So <laughs> that's where we get, that's where we get the, the dark, uh, the dark silver color. A little bit of a shake up there, isn't it, Barry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Deanna, tell us about the 4-H. What is it exactly for people who don't know and when they come to the fair and they can check it out and learn about it? 4-H is really, it's a youth program. It's designed to help youth get regular skill sets. There's home crafts, there's baking, there's cooking, and then there's livestock, so dairy, beef, sheep, etc. And it's really to get those skills to take you on farther on in life, those transfer, transferable skills. Yeah, so what? So the benefits of that, I mean, tell us about it. I think people really get some confidence, public speaking, social interactions with like-minded individuals. It's really about building those career uh, goal-oriented tasks. Right, and especially in life skills as well, mm -hmm. right, Deanna? So this weekend, people can come down. I mean, there's so much to see here at the Rockton World's Fair, and one of them being the 4-H Club. So people would come over to the barns, to the showrooms. Is that how they would find Paige here in Holly? Exactly. Every day there's a different show, whether it's dairy, beef, sheep, that's 
yeah, you never know what you're going to find in the barn, so come check it out. Wonderful. And one more thing, Barry, what else yeah. can you tell us about Holly here? She seems like she's ready to move out and about, but uh, Paige is handling her pretty well. She's been up since 6.30 this morning, so she's been standing for a while. We washed her, clipped her, and got her ready to come here, so she's been up for a while. She just wants to go back home and lay down in the pasture, probably. <laughs> maybe she should be a part of Morning Live. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, we're here, a family affair. Come on down the Rockton World's Fair. Again, the weather is going to be beautiful. Fall is in the air and Holly be jolly. Yeah, that's what I look like in the morning. <laughs> Good morning. We're at the Rockton World's Fair. It's about to begin. We're getting a little sneak peek here this morning, open later on. 4 p.m. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, running all weekend. President here, Deanna. We're just loving these pinks, right? Yeah, thanks. thanks for having us. They're definitely energetic today. They're energetic and they're so cute. They are. What kind of a pig is that? They're Cooney Coonies from New Zealand. Wow, and the babies are so sweet. I, I don't know, I can't figure out if she likes the camera or not. She was kind of grunting at us earlier. So we're standing in a tent with some pigs, horses. We're gonna go meet the bunnies, but what is this? This is all about agricultural education. It's about learning what different animals are, what the kind of their purpose is, and kind of getting up close and personal to have that experience. It's wonderful. Okay, let's walk over to the bunnies now, Deanna. And I think she's trying to get you, Justin. <laughs> Be careful. Okay, so when families come, I, I would imagine that children really like it. This yes. part of it all, and it'll be filled with animals, right, Deanna? It will, yep, and a little corn box and everything. Oh, that's so nice. And we're about to hold the baby bunnies morning live. Okay, is there a certain way, Paige, I'm supposed to hold her just like that? Oh, you sweet little thing. Oh, look it. Do you want to hold a bunny too, Deanna? Absolutely. Okay, there. Okay, so when people come again, to the fair, is this tent open all weekend or is it just a certain time? It's open all, whenever the fair is open, this tent is open, so oh. come check it out. Wonderful, and when people wanna come and get tickets, do you order online or can you get them at the front entrance? Both. Both, okay, so they would go to the Rockton World's Fair website. Exactly, you can buy online or you can come to the gate and buy at the gate through a kiosk or through a person. And what about parking? How does that work? There is lots of parking yeah. on site and if you end up parking out in the middle of nowhere we will shuttle you to the gate. Oh there's a shuttle as well. Wonderful and lots of great food, lots of rides and again this is the Ag Alive tent where you can meet these cute little bunnies and the cute little pigs over there and a whole lot of other animals that are getting ready to fill this tent with a lot of people who know a lot of stuff about them, right? You can ask questions, Deanna? Yep, the owners or people that know about animals will be here. All right, well, we love this fair and we hope that you'll love it too or maybe you've been here many times and want to come back. It all begins later on today, 4 p.m. Saturday and Sunday and we'll see you there. Hey, from way up in the sky, we are at the Rockton World's Fair. Getting a sneak peek, Deanna, do you like rides? Some days, depending <laughs> on the ride. <laughs> Some days. This is the president, everybody, of the Rockton World's Fair. We are on the Ferris wheel talking about one of the most beloved parts of the fair, the rides. I mean, a lot of people do like them, and we're getting a beautiful view. You can see all the leaves are changing on the trees, and everyone's getting ready, right, for the fair. They are. It's yes. a lot of work, Deanna. It is a lot of work. It takes countless volunteers to put this on, and we couldn't do it without them. Yeah, walking around, I see the that you all get along really well. There's there's a nice sense of community here and everyone seems really excited to just get this going. Yes, we're, we're a fair family. <laughs> yeah, for sure. And can you tell us about tickets so people can get them online or at the gate? That's and correct. What does that include, the ticket? So that would include the demolition derby. There is limited seating, so you'll want to get here early to reserve and guarantee your seat. It includes the numerous different stages with different musicians, and there's an online schedule that you can look at. Um, it includes the buildings and all the different exhibits, the livestock, the egg alive tent, different things like that. What's your favorite part of the fair? I grew up showing 4-H dairy cows, Aww. so that's my favorite part. Oh, 
Oh, so when we were talking to Paige earlier, that was you once upon a time. It was. And look at you now, you're the president. What made you want to be the president of the fair? It's just, I've always grown up coming here since probably the day I was born. So <laughs> I just thought it's a great thing to be a part of and it was always one of my aspirations. And when you say here, we're in Rockton. For people watching that have never been here, whereabouts would you, or how would you describe its location? It's in between Hamilton and Cambridge, just off Highway 8. Okay, so opening today at 4 p.m., Friday, right. Saturday, and Sunday. Yes. All right, and then Sunday, what time does, do things wrap up? Uh, normally in the evening, the demolition derby starts at 5.30, and then after the derby, the midway's open for a little longer. We are open Monday as well, but oh. we close around 5 o'clock. Oh, well, that's good. So Monday as well, of course, Thanksgiving Monday. So four days or kind of three and a half yeah. days to come on down and check out the Rockton World's Fair because they say, why is it called the World's Fair? Because Deanna says it's the greatest. And if you'd like to check it out, you can come down and maybe you'll think so too. Look at that view.